reference by style, cross-reference by size, and reverse index by fabric. She'll be able to find anything in three seconds flat. It was some of my best work. Spike, you're back. How do I look? Great! And more importantly, how does the castle look? Great! Before we continue with this video, I want to go ahead and give a shout out to today's sponsors, which is Easy SMX Kid Headphones. Look, you guys love music. A lot of you guys are parents or you sat your kids in front of this video while you go off and party because you're a bad parent. But you can make up for that by getting them this. This will actually keep them from going deaf and probably help you keep your sanity as they listen to the Frozen song 24-7 blaring out of their headphones by limiting the noise to 85 decibels. To put it into perspective, here's some nondescript headphones that I personally use at full value. And of course, we'll use only the most appropriate song. And in contrast, here's the noise limiting headphones by Easy SMX. It's a huge difference. You're not going to be annoyed, and your child's going to be safe. It's durable, it's bendable, go ahead, twist it, throw it, do whatever, it's not gonna break. It's small and compact, so you can also store it places while you go on trips, or on airplanes, or wherever. It's a standard headphone, so it's going to work with your iPods, your iPhones, your Zooms if you still have those, and anything else that has a 3.5mm jack. It's on Amazon right now, so over a hundred positive reviews, so you already know it's good. You guys already know the internet's a dangerous place, but with these, you can at least ensure that they won't be going deaf anytime soon. So parents watching, be sure to go ahead and get this for your kids. Support our sponsors for supporting us, and uh, let's get back to the compilations. <gasps> Winter wrap-up! You're not mommy. Ponyville was started by Earth Ponies, so for hundreds of years they've never used magic to clean up winter. It's traditional. <sighs> Perfect! Oh, yes, this is good. No one will recognize you. Why wouldn't I want to be... And we'll need a disguise for your dog. Which is too bad. <sighs> I give up. Give what up, Twy? Doesn't mean it's guaranteed to happen. But that doesn't stop them from expecting it. Which only makes things harder because the last thing you want to do is... Let, let everybody, everybody down. down. I didn't realize how hungry I was. I'm so glad you asked me to join you here today. I'm so honored. And can I get mine with extra oats? Oats? Uh, scratch that. However you normally make it is fine. You know me. <laughs> Always trying to make a big splash around here. Because my drink kind of splashed on the ground. <laughs> I'm gonna go over there now. Um, I don't mean to sound unappreciative, but has any pony else noticed that Twilight's been a little too helpful lately? Now that you mention it... I win! Huh? I'm Pancake! I mean, awake! Need a quick nap. Napkin! Tell the delicate song! She's been awake three straight days preparing for the summit. You gotta really flap them hard. Uh, uh, oh. Oh. Uh, maybe not 
quite that hard. I'd like to make you my own personal protege here at the school. Yes! One other thing, Twilight. More? Thank goodness I had time to whip up a few charts on flight patterns and wing symmetry. It's fresh in my mind from when I learned to fly. This is so exciting! Maybe for you. <sighs> Wake up, newbies! Fly to session! If you hadn't used magic, you'd have heard me say, uh, this plate represents your head, this spoon is your heart, and the knives are sharp. Always be careful with knives. Okay, no problem. Just put the hay in the apple and eat the candle. That's right. But she's afraid of quesadillas. No, I'm not. They're just so <laughs> cheesy. I'm bored. Huh? Does something need scheduling? What in the name of Celestia is going on up there? Prepare yourselves, every pony. Winter is coming.